and this huge habanero pepper. Right now I'm thinking, why am I gonna put this in my mouth? As soon as I bite it, it's so wide, it goes past my teeth on both sides. I have to pry it down from the top of my mouth. It's already hot. Habaneros have a delayed heat reaction, so now I can feel the first heat. I know the second wave is coming, and I'm not happy about it. You can smell it from his breath. Right there, I swallowed the first half of the pepper. Now I have to chew the second half because it's so it so big. All right, it's all completely swallowed at this point. The pain's getting very intense. You can see me like kind of moving around in my seat. It's getting worse. The water's helping a little bit just because it's cooling, but the heat, the main heat is not in the mouth, it's in the back of the throat. There's nothing I can do about it. I put the ice in there, the ice does nothing. It can't go to the back of my mouth. It literally <sighs> does nothing. I'm hurting really bad right now. I'm thinking, how am I gonna put this heat out? What am I going to do? The only thing I could do is swallow something. So, really bad spit the ice out, start with the water. The water's not doing anything. Absolutely nothing. Way worse than you let on. It's so hot. <laughs> so I got this biscotti. I'm like, no, the biscotti won't work. What else do I have? All this apple. So I just start chowing on the apple. I hurt everywhere. I hurt everywhere. Pain. I am in intense pain. This apple is the only soothing thing. It only helps when I'm actually My swallowing. Go away. My nose starting to run. Finally, you can see how much I'm moving around. It's just intense. I mean, I can't sit still. I, it's just everything I can do to control it. <laughs> it's like a broken bone or a torn ACL or a wrenched ankle, but just in your throat. Oh, you're so hot you want to die. <laughs> And you know you can't get rid of it. It's just in there. So I'm trying to move around. What can I do? There's nothing I can do. I know I have to wait it out. Keep chomping on my apple. I try the ice again. Stupid. Ice does nothing. I'm trying to get the ice to the back of my throat, but I can't because it's back the throat so not hard. shaped well. Spit that out. Oh, back to the apple. Throw that ice away. Missed the trash can. Just landed on the floor. I didn't even care. I told though. The intensity is out of control right now. It's so bad. It's so bad. I will never eat another one. This what I just feel like dying for sure. It's so bad. I don't know how it's gonna go away. I just can't imagine. I have to find my center. <laughs> I thought if I laid still, it would go away, or I could focus, or I could escape. No, nope. Way, way brutal. Just so brutal. Pain. Back to the apple. Is so much pain. I'm so calm while I'm saying that, but you, know, you can see from my body actions, my eyes, how jittery I am. It's not normal. Way. Oh, yeah, my hands start shaking. Um, just because the pain's so intense. Just ugh, brutal pain. I mean, we're four, almost four and a half minutes into the pain cycle now. The <clears throat> I'm wondering when it's going to end. I can start talking now a little bit. It's like engaging conversation. It feels like a butane torch to the back of your throat. It's like fire. The mouth is hurt. But the back of the throat really hurt. The two guys with me have pepper experience. That was a huge pepper.
had to chew in two parts. <laughs> my first bit I had, I fought on my teeth because it was so big. Uh, explaining what I just told you. You can see on the door on the left side we have the capsaicin. We have a okay. Carolina Reaper pepper over there. And then we have the Scoville, Scoville scale just to the left of that. So the question is, for those five and a half minutes, oh. can you withstand the worst pain you've ever had in your life? Concentrate right here. I can't bear to watch this. Finally, it's cooling down. Unreal. That was unbelievable. Unbelievable. Unmatched pain. <laughs> Three and a half minutes for unmatched pain. And I've had some serious injuries. This is by far the worst. I'm back down to crazy hot now. But like before, it was literally. You don't know what to do. See, even then I drop the cap on the floor and I don't care. I mean, I'm just trying to get the pain to go away. It's... That's why you don't eat habanero peppers. <laughs>